all right so it's more merlin content for you guys i know man she looks absolutely stunning she got amazing um aesthetics you feel me so we definitely gonna keep showcasing her um it's between her or Lydia that i want to really showcase i have some team ideas that i really want to try out but um this team what i'm gonna be trying out is gonna be the baddie team you know we got albedo we got sabnak and then you know nanashi the baddest of them all and we are just gonna be using these type of team again merlin gives you like 15 percent base stats for your unknown so you have 15 percent base stats and then you have 30 percent from nanashi giving you a whopping 45 percent basic stats and then you know you have sabnak here who is one of the best you are festival to run on the unknown team and albedo you already know from the past history that albedo was just a decent support character for unknown give you that attack boost once her stance is gone or even protecting your team with her own stance so hopefully you guys enjoyed the video again make sure you guys like and subscribe again let's see what we can do all right let's see what we got here oh e. oh we out cc though i was thinking to myself like oh i might be in danger i might be in trouble it's like oh no i out cc all right and here comes merlin with the boat So we're gonna do some damage right here and then come in with the boat doesn't matter this is gonna be an aoe anyways so we stun his team and then afterwards i'll just most likely go for my albedo stance usually you want to put up albedo stance uh beforehand just so you get that attack boost as well as those counter damage but it don't really matter like we have merlin giving us even more base stats on our team so we're in a really good position and you gotta remember, we're also gonna get our debuff effects with Merlin as well, too. Because of those elements. Oh, it look like Eskin about to get stunned as well, too. Oh, wow. So you lost two characters at that moment. Very unfortunate. I guess for his last character, I can just have um, Merlin just hit him with a gold card. And that's death. Oh, dang, I missed the crit. All right, let's see. Let's see. All right, GG. And now we can just use Merlin Gold Car for the memes. Especially because we got attack boost as well. Ooh, and we got a boat. Know what happens when we got the boat. Good things happen when we got the boat. Because you... So he's losing his HP as well, so. Alright, let's see. Got him. Dang, that did a lot. Not as much as this. Ow. GG. GG, my boy. We got a, a Lilia team. Oh my god. So, you know, he, since he's using Lilia, you already know. The chances of him losing have now skyrocketed. <laughs> I'm so toxic. I mean, he's lucky I'm not using Fatoria because Fatoria would have just hard counter her. So you might actually see her pop off in this video because I'm not running Fatoria, the most common character. And god dang, uh, Grand Cross. And she's a collab. She's even more crazy when you think about it. Uh uh uh. Hmm. I guess you can go for this then. Uh. I don't know. It's like you really don't have a a hand to play around with sometimes. Like I could just easily just troll his other characters instead. He's gonna like, most likely just cleanse those debuffs. Oh my god, the Eskinar showcase. Let's go. Again, no Fatori means I just I'm I'm just gonna lose against the Lilia. Anything. 
Hopefully I don't. Let's see the damage right here. Okay, that's really good. Yeah, Eskin are still gonna take a lot of damage right here. This man loves AoE. Yo, yo, Lilia is right there. You wanna use the cards? Ah, oh, you didn't want to use it? Okay. I was say, like, her cards are like right there, my guy. <laughs> Unfortunately, I have like nothing at the moment. Like, maybe I could probably push for my ultimates. Um, but in terms of like my hand, it's really bad. Alright. Alright, hopefully it stuns him. He, he takes away what two two of my uh, buffs debuffs. Nice. We just cleared out this man's hand. Now unfortunately I look at my hand. Oh my god. My can is garbage. Holy snap. Bro, why do I have a whole handful of Merlin cards? She's not even my best character. Oh, he just forfeits. GG. Well, at least we sealed that man's hand. All right, he probably thought like, yo, it's going to be over for me because he has probably a million stop knock cards. But no, my whole hand filled with legit Merlin trash. All right, we got a blue fraudulent team in PvP. Let's go. I love my, I love my blue, my blue, my blue fr fraudy. And this man is using uh what, what is that? Who is that again? He's rocking Demon King too. This is kinda cringe. Like who who do I go for? I think I gotta go for Demon King. Cause I have no character who can freaking D rank guards. Alright, he's dodged. Ooh, that's cute. He might just push for his ultimate on me. Like, all you guys do is have Frogger just attack into me, and then I can't really do much. Well, I could debuff him. That is also something I can do. Okay, he lost his Frogger. He got his 5 gauge. But we, what we got, guys, we got that boost. We got that pop, we got that poppy boost right there. Um. Did he return me like anybody? Right, I'm just going for this then. <coughs> All right, GG. Because remember, we got the attack boost from Albedo, so it was going to be GG regardless. I was just waiting to see what he was going to do. He chose to do no nothing to me. All right, we got somebody who LCCs us, and he's rocking for Toria, but it doesn't even matter, does it? <clears throat> is he even trying to set up oh no he's not he's not even trying to set up on me he's gonna try do like a double take on us let's go love that <laughs> i love that about you he's gonna you're gonna be cringe this entire uh playthrough let's go uh-huh I guess I, I guess I can use my boat. Okay. Here comes the boat. Let me stun his uh Fatoria. That's how Fatoria was like his lowest HP character, so I definitely just go for the stun. All right, beautiful. All right, and what we can do again is go for the stun again. On either his Victoria or his entire team. I'm actually debate. I, mm, I probably want to go for this. Actually, yeah, we can go for this. Because Merlin has our ultimates. Yeah, because of stun and taxu. 
and you locked again. Yeah, this man, I already know he hates me. And then we got another debuff. Oh, he got the best debuff on me. <sighs> that sucks. Actually sucks. All right, I gotta go for this then. Oh crap. He got the he had the best debuff on us. Okay. Alright. So we have um I mean we're gonna get stunned on Merlin, but that's besides the point. That debuff, oh my god, the, the fact that that debuff lasts so long is crazy. Okay, he got that going for himself. So the best thing we can do is throw up my stance, ult, and I guess we can go for you. Because we've been stalling this man now forever. Oh my god, no Nanashi? No basis stat boost? Yeah, that's GG. Nah, he got cooked. That man got cooked. We definitely hit him with that mental uh illness, okay? Holy snap. Or what is it called? Mental disorder? Something. Something mental. Mental illusion. That's what it is. Yeah. We hit we hit him with all that. Dang, son. And that's death. GG, my boy. GG. Death by a baddie. A lot, man. I, I, I recommend just, like, if you're using this team or using Merlin, do something for her. Just use Fatori, man. Like, it's just, like, it's just pointless using, uh, It just use it's just like it's just literally just pointless using this type of team. If you're not gonna use like Victoria. I'll be honest. It's just Victoria just so good, man. It's, it's kinda sad that I gotta say, like, yo, Victoria is like really good, especially because she's a collab character, but it just so it makes her life easier. And this guy's running SR Liz in the back. How the heck did he just heal? Any stun. Yep. Sorry, he didn't. He couldn't figure that out. Oh, why he got stunned? They gave us the extra play. All right. So now his um. So now he's gonna be stunned. I guess we can go for this too. Then we go for another debuff and then do this as well. Cause he's gonna have like at least two characters stunned. Hopefully his not when he doesn't get it, doesn't have another stance. If his not he doesn't have another stance, we, we kind of win. If his not he does not have a stance, we win. If he does have a stance, it's pretty much GG for us. Oh my God, he does have another stance. And his ultimate, wow. Wait, can I be able to clutch? Oh my god, 100k is crazy. And then Arthur is dead to the freaking flame debuff. That is so not that is so nice. And it's gonna be ult. So my best bet is to probably get rid of Nalf when we right here. I was thinking about maybe Eskinor, but let's see what happens. Yeah. And we already know he has SR Liz in the back because he was healing like a madman. <gasps> oh my god, are you serious? Are you are you trolling me? He merged into a gold card? Bro, please be one out of six. Please be one out of six. That is insane. Okay, he's low dupes. Okay. 
Holy snap. I'm like, bro. Alright, so I'm not I need you to take take never mind. Someone please don't take that damage. That was a lot. Holy Yeah, Merlin, you gotta go. That was insane. He merged into a gold single card. Wow. And I can't even push for my ultimate with this. <sighs> this is crazy, bro. It's actually insane. I did a lot of damage right there, but it doesn't matter because I don't have my ultimate. And that was a single target, which is actually really nice for us. So with this, I'll just go for my um my enough my Nanashi card. Actually, no, I I I just don't want to risk this now, because what if this deletes? No, it deletes the far right. And nah, I'm just going for this. To get it. I ain't gonna risk it. GG. Yeah, I was not gonna risk it no more, man. Because after seeing that gold card, like my whole life just flashed me. Flash through my eyes. Well, I'm I'm just gonna leave that as the last match. It was kind of really interesting. So hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. Uh, make sure you guys like and subscribe again. Um, Merlin with uh, Albedo. Um, it's the baddie team.